Okay, you've heard me talk about swing plane in previous videos, and today what I want to do is to put some science, some data, and some numbers and some angles into what that swing plane is. My favourite way of describing a swing plane is that it's the rotational angle the sweet spot takes around the body. We hit the golf ball with the sweet spot and we measure that angle it swings around the body. An upright swing plane is that, a flat swing plane is that, we're somewhere in between the two. What I'm going to do now is set myself up to do this perfectly straight shot. That won't happen, I assure you. And I'm going to swing as neutrally as possible to try and see what happens and put some data into this now. Alrighty. Not my best strike, but it gets the point across. So, carry it 255. Total distance 272. I've lost a bit of distance there. It wasn't my best strike at all, but who cares? I'm pretty happy with 272. Now, my club path there was 0.1. Minus means it's just slightly across it. So if that's within 0.1 of a degree of 0, 0, absolutely perfectly straight to the ball, I'd be very happy with what I was attempting to do there. Now, this is the big number here, this 45.9 degrees of swing plane. And I think it's a great image for you that if you want to truly understand how the club swings around the body. We set ourselves up the ball, we tilt forwards, we therefore swing the club around the body here. If I just swung that at 45.9 degrees, I think it's a fantastic image. That's 90, that's zero, so 45 is about there. If I were to swing my club around my body and swing down, and just stop the club halfway down at 45 degrees, that club shaft now is pointing down more or less where the ball is. Now if that's the case, and I swing up to here and down at have that image of 45 degrees here, then surely that's that optimum way for that club to enter into the back of the ball. And then you start to put all these things together. So when I do my clapping exercise, it's more or less a 45 degree line up and down. I wouldn't come from here to do it on a straight line to do it. So that image of 45 degrees in a golf swing is a tremendous one. So when you're rehearsing your swing at home during the lockdown, up, down, have a look at it in the mirror, is it at 45 degrees? You can see on my trackman data there at 45.9 degrees. I've been hitting quite a few shots today. They've all been there and thereabouts. I think it's a fantastic way of solidifying the art, the science, and all the numbers and the positions and the images of what the swing plane actually is. So good luck with your practice.